What are some traits that makes an introvert a little more fun to be around? And this definitely looks a little different than extroverts. And let's get started. This first trait that I want to talk about is something that I almost only see in people who are soft spoken. This is low profile humor. Take a look at Steven here. You could imagine very tall, pale, kind man getting naked with you. That's like, it's like up there, you know? You can see that this is something a little more subtle and something that kind of gives you a little chuckle. But that little bit does amazing things in terms of making you fun. You're allowed to do that? And um, you're allowed to do that. And, yeah. Um, I signed up. Okay. And they allowed me to do that. And what were you... What? <laughs> in this style, you don't have to be really loud or talkative to be able to enjoy conversations. That sounds pretty good, right? I mean, I'm totally down for it. I tried to get this little extra degree in neuroscience, but turns out uh, you have to be... Uh, smart? To... Yeah, 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 yeah. So use these low profile humor to your advantage. Things like puns, awkward silences, small sarcasms. It's possible to do all these things while still being very polite and respectful. Hey, it's Augustus here, and if you like what you're seeing so far, hit that like button so I know to make more stuff like this. Now, I want to start off this next trait by asking you this question How many times have you told yourself? I don't really like that person because of the person's attitude. If you have said that to yourself before, then you understand just how important your attitude is in terms of if someone actually likes you. Listen to Steven's attitude here. A lot of different things, including different cultures, different people, different points of view. And that's kind of what makes this country so beautiful. I wouldn't know the answer to your question. The words I will use to describe him is honest, thoughtful, and unassuming. And for some of us, Honesty might actually look like saying the things that you want to say rather than saying things that you want other people to hear. You know, sometimes I think that the life of a dog might be just so much easier. Anyways, this next trait is very useful in terms of making other people feel more easy going or relaxed, especially for introverts. And this is having a slower and relaxed pace. Has any of your college <coughs> studies helped you in your career so far? It's either, it's either yes or you can see that he isn't exactly in a rush to finish off his thoughts, nor does he come off as very aggressive. And this gives you a nice, calmer feeling when you're talking to him. Bad TV. It was, uh, it was an interesting uh, couple of weeks. It was, yeah. On the web, it's like people were... Yeah. There was just, just like meme, meme... It's really the small things that makes big differences. And most people don't pay attention to these things. This last trait is a lot more active, and it is your turn to take control by sharing your insights. People are not interested in topics. They want to listen to an interesting perspective or experience. Are we who we want us ourselves to be, or are we kind of like the sum of other people's projections onto us? And um, what does that do to your life? If you can share a thought that's a little more deeper, something introverts are especially good at, sometimes a little too much. It can make you more enjoyable to talk to because you're introducing experience and story. So do you like these traits I talked about? You can let me know in the comments or else I have no way of knowing. If you're interested in removing people pleasing tendencies, I made something else on that. Or otherwise, you can check out some of my other videos.